first time for me. Gonna hit the sensory deprivation tank. Heard a lot of great things about it. The sun people always travel single file to hide their numbers. Hey buddy, Bado here. We're just at uh, Flotarium and JDS is in the pod. We're gonna check it out. He's almost done here, so we're gonna see how the final results turned out for him, okay? Let's go, let's go see what's going on here, okay? Follow me. Just come on, come on. I'm going to hop out and have a nice shower. Uh, finished showering, had a nice 90 minute isolation time, just me and myself. Pretty cool experience. I think 90 minutes is perfect. An hour probably wouldn't have been enough. Time goes by very fast. I'm surprised uh, you just kind of get lost. Next thing you know, the lights are coming on, the music starts playing. As soon as you get in the water, it's not cold, it's not hot. It's like, I think it's probably about 98 degrees, whatever our human body temperature is. Whether you, whether you open your eyes or close your eyes, it's just pitch black, which is cool. And yeah, I just kind of well, got lost a few times, almost nodded off sleeping a couple times. It's just that calming. It's water and salt yourself in darkness. It doesn't get much more natural than that. Uh, after that, I had a nice shower, got the salt off, showered off, and I'm just to toweling off. Feeling refreshed. Thanks for checking in. I'll see you on the other side. JDS, ciao. I'm gonna hop in the shower here, so uh, I'm gonna kick you guys out. Okay? See you 90. Okay, I just closed the pod. I'm gonna press the button. And I'm gonna be gone for 90 minutes. I'm floating, and now the process will begin. It's go time. While you're floating, your face is gonna be exposed to the air somewhat like this. And the number one thing you want to avoid doing while you're floating is touching your face, okay? Because you got salt water on your hands. If you bring your hands up here at all, uh, you're probably gonna end up with a bead of salt water that comes down into the corner of your eye. So that's why it's important to make sure your face is dry before you float, just to kind of reduce the chance of you wanting to touch your face. If by chance, at any time during your float, uh, you get some salt water in your eyes, because sometimes it does happen. Sean lasted 10 minutes, and he, I, hear him, I hear him screaming, ah! But if you do get uh, salt water in your eye, take this, just regular water, spray your eyes down, and then you can use the towel again to dry your face, okay? Two people can go in here? We tried, it's 
Well, two small people, yeah. But two Japanese kind of, people. Yeah, you're kind of like this though. Like, yeah. there's Whereas, like, you like to kind of be like a uh, starfish though yeah. and stuff, right? I got it. Yeah. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. This silver button here is an intercom. That's hooked upstairs at all times. You have the ability to contact me. I can you, talk. If you need to. You can tell a story. Tell, tell me a joke. You could, yeah. You could talk back to me. We could do that if you like. <laughs> Uh, but I get you to use it. First thing you do is you're gonna come here, you're gonna just push the buzzer once, okay? And then I know that you're in the tank, and then when I hear the buzzer, I'm gonna start the program on the computer, and then your phone's gonna be in session, okay? When I start the computer, uh, the light and the circulation pump, all that's gonna shut down, okay? And then your phone will be in session. Exclusive interview right out of the tank. I dozed off and I had dreams. We were driving <laughs> on the highway. We we're going back to Vancouver in a hurry. I'm gonna get some clothes on and I will talk to you as soon as I'm dressed, okay? Okay. okay. Alright, okay. we're out, we're out, we're okay. out. Okay. See ya. See ya. See ya. Ah! What happened to my hair? I guess it's gone black. I don't understand. So we got some beef, bap, bap, boogie, 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 for you boys. I don't know what the salt did. Something did, it did something to my hair. Let's go talk to the owner. How's it going, Coach? Good. Yeah? Yeah? Good. It's good. I had a little bit of an experience in there. Oh, yeah? Uh, passed out. They, I was dreaming. Dreaming we're on the road, trying to rush back to Vancouver. Muscle twitches, uh, body spasms. Yeah, yeah. It was like you wake up, like like you would wake no, up. No, while I'm sleeping, I can feel. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Because of my right now, I got that derm damage oh, on the okay. spine, so they don't know what's wrong with me. Really? Yeah. Uh, did you guys either? You get into like your heart at all? Like where you feel like you like you're in like a zone where all you hear is like. A little bit. Yeah, it was good. It was good. Good, good times. It did go by quick. At first I thought it was going to take a long time because when I'm in the water, I like to be moving in the water. Yeah. Well, actually, I like to be down. It's Ryan, come visit him at the Floatarium. 